Hey guys, this is Mups and I have been challenged by Shield to do the Move More at Home challenge. And the one I'm going to be doing today is called the Spell Your Name Workout. Now if you don't know what that is, then I think you'll find it pretty cool because you basically spell your name and that equals to a certain workout. So each letter in the alphabet that your name represents also represents a workout and it looks a little bit like this. But if you didn't get all of that, don't worry, we're going to have it at the end of the video for you to check it out, freeze the frame and do the workout for yourself too. So I'm pretty lucky that I have a fairly short name, it's only four letters, but don't take this challenge um, lightly, it is quite a rigorous workout and the best thing is to do it as best as you can with really good form and then you'll get the best results but I feel sorry for you if your name is Genevieve or Mohammed or Spogazi or Spamanta or even Forgiveness but good luck all right so the first one is the letter M and M is representative of 20 burpees and the best thing or the main thing to focus on when you're doing your burpees just like with every other exercise is your form you want to do them properly if it's a little bit too challenging to do a full burpee you can do a half burpee um, you can either go into a push-up or go into a plank position and make sure that you're going all the way down and extending all the way back up with a jump and this is what it basically looks like So those were my first 20 burpees and I say first because the letter A represents 10 burpees so I'm going to have to make sure that I do another 10. I told you this wasn't easy. <sighs> okay, so now we are 30 burpees in, first one was 20, second one is 10. And now the letter P represents 20 squats. The main thing we want to focus on the squats is to ensure that you try and put your weight on your back heels, ensure that your knees never roll over your toes, and try to go as low as you possibly can. When you come up, try and thrust forward while you tighten your glutes and then you will activate what needs to be activated. And those were my 20 squats. And now on to the last one, the letter S, and that represents 25 tricep dips. So for that, you're gonna want a platform that you can lean on, put your arms on, so either a chair or an ottoman, or any kind of thing that you can kind of grab around the house and allow yourself to get a little bit of height, a little bit of height off the ground. You wanna get your elbows as far back and straight as you can, legs out, and you just dip down to the bottom and give yourself back up there. And that's it, 25 tricep dips. And that ends the spell your name workout for me. M A P S. 20 burpees, 10 burpees, and then for P we have 20 squats, and for S 25 tricep dips. If you've got a really long name, then good luck to you. If you've got a short name like I do, try to do a couple sets so that you get in a really full workout. But ensure that when you do this challenge, 
tag a friend, hashtag move more at home, and also make sure that you tag Shield and challenge all the people that you know to stay at home and stay fit.